She's like, I'm too intelligent just to be standing here. I need help. Let me go get some meat for my family. They're, we are all gonna starve if we don't have any kind of meat. Oh, he's like, you are my favorite, Latisse. I just really like you. And here he is with his little friends playing some archery, practicing. Feels like Latisse and Elias ganged up on Andrew and ended up beating him two to one. What? Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. She was, she just ran in here, y'all. She just ran in here. But because I queued take a bath, she didn't do it. I think she was coming in here to throw up, yo. Hello, all you wonderful and fabulous people. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back for some more of the Ultimate Decades Challenge. So y'all, I am literally recording this right after the last episode. So the other episode hasn't even gone up. So I haven't seen any comments on that video. So, you know, there's that. I just wanted to know I'm not ignoring you. I just have recording back to back episodes. I got a busy week coming up, so. I am trying to get ahead of the videos, so that's what we're doing today. But anyways, we're back. I'm so excited to be playing this. I'm just really, really liking this gameplay. The one thing I don't like is that Margaret here is not able to get pregnant. But what do you expect with 20%? I'm going to keep saying that because it kind of is frustrating. But we'll keep doing it. It makes it a challenge. Hopefully this time. I mean, this is like, let's see. He came home in 1360. It is now... 1362 so this is the sixth time we have tried for a baby six times y'all and she's still not pregnant so hopefully we can get her to get pregnant eventually i guess but it is the first quarter of 1362 so we're still about seven years from the war so we still got a bit of time last time we did also adopt this freya who is very hungry and is not happy at all. She's gonna go lay down. Oh, she's gonna go. What's that? The grass. She is just a little horse, a fowl. I don't have a lot planned for this episode. It is the 100th episode, by the way. No, I don't have anything special planned. You know, it's just how it is. I thought maybe I would, but I don't. So there it is. But I can't believe we're 100 episodes in and we are nearing, we're closer to the end of this century, but we still got a ways to go, you know? Also, last time, Edric did take a job as a blacksmith. So he is now level three. We're just going to be plugging away on that. He's literally going to be going to work here in a little bit. And we had Margaret quit her job so she could stay home and focus on the family and hopefully have more babies. Otherwise, we're just taking care of this house. Uh, I think I'm going to have her go hunting this morning or either I have Edric get up very early before he goes out to his job. And I don't know. We'll have to see when they're all going to get up and get around. His work starts at... Oh, he doesn't have to go to work till 12. Oh, his hours have changed. He doesn't have to go to work till 12 p.m., but he does work later into the evening, I see. All right. Well, I'm going to let them get their rest, and then we'll be going about our day here in just a bit. And apparently, this little horse is throwing a tantrum. Okay. She'd be throwing a fit. She's like, I'm too intelligent just to be standing here. I need help. Yo, I need help. And all my goats and sheep want to leave. You know. And it is for... I'm actually going to make him get up. And he can use this. He's going to have to come. He's depressed from losing a family that is very distant to us. Oh, now she's going to sleep. Oh, here we have the smelliness. Here we have uh, this goat who is unhappy and starving. We're going to call him over. And then we can uh, take care of him. Okay, he's got him awake. We'll go ahead and feed him and we will clean. Actually, scratch that. We're not. I'm going to actually have him uh, grab something to eat. No, we're going to go out hunting. I'm just going to send him straight out to hunting because we need the meat really bad. And just like that, he has confidence. He's like, oh, yeah, let me go get some meat. Let me go get some meat for my family. They're, we are all going to starve if we don't have any kind of meat. And Andrew needs to get up and have himself a shower or bath desperately. You know what? I think I realized I never connected them to the power grid again. I did it. Dang it. Okay, there it is. And so he is going to need to go get some water. I thought it was funny that they could take all these baths and have to not gather water. 
Um, oopsie. Okay, we got the water finally. Now he can go have himself a bath. Oh, and Edric has come back just now. Oh, and here's our ranch hand. Okay, so I'm wondering, I'm wondering if I can change their outfit to more medieval. I did save, so I'm wondering if I can just modify him and cast. I'm wondering if that's going to ruin anything. So I can come in here to uh, change him, but I'm just afraid that he, his work outfit is not going to be medieval. Maybe I just change his like one outfit and then copy and paste it in the MC command center to everything. So I am going to just quickly pick something that is maybe like more of a work outfit. I don't know what would be a work outfit, maybe something, or maybe I just put on this. Okay, so I real quick just changed his hair to this and colored, you know, made his uh, beard and eyebrows match and changed him to this outfit. We'll see if this is gonna work. Now I should be able to come here to the dresser and change outfit to this, and then we can copy outfit and then we can paste outfit to everything. Wait, paste outfit. It doesn't give me the option to paste it. It just keeps coming back to this. See, it doesn't let me actually paste it to every day or not. Dang. Oh, well, I'll just have to make sure that he changes it. Well, anyways, so he's thinking about a family member. I am going to, what did we get from hunting? All right. So we did get a venison and we did get chicken and a squirrel. I'm going to have him cut this meat and we got some low quality meat, which is what we're after. And we'll go ahead and keep this chicken and we'll put this venison in here as well. We also got a chocolate egg that I'm going to sell and we have six more eggs. There we go. I think that's all. Oh, he's got wool and stuff on him. Okay, so he's going to be going to work in five hours, apparently. I'm going to have him come in here and grab some of this. And she's still in bed, yo. She need to get up. She need to use the bathroom. And I'm going to have Margaret go ahead and uh, go take a bath. Oh, oh, wait, wait, wait. She, was, she just ran in here, y'all. She just ran in here, but because I queued take a bath, she didn't do it. I think she was coming in here to throw up, yo. I think I stopped her from throwing up. All right, Andrew, it is time for you to come and clean this cow. Oh, apparently the cow doesn't need to be cleaned. Hey there, I'm your ranch hand. The name is Suzuki. Nice to meet y'all. I'm good with animals, plants, and repairs. Let me know and I'll handle it. The ranch is going to run like a well-oiled machine. Oh, and if you want me to harvest plants or pick up manure, just ask. Otherwise, I'll leave it to you. I want to make sure that's all you'd want. You never know. All right. So I think that's going to be of great help now. I know some of you guys were asking if I could do that. I, I definitely think that they're high enough up in the status now that they could probably have a little bit of help. Edric is making decent money as blacksmith. He is supplying weapons for war to the war and everything. I feel like that would be some kind of you know, they'd be able to afford some kind of help by this point. Oh, and guess what? We just got notified. I was just about to have them try for a baby. We are finally eating for two. And she's just sitting down to tell them the big news. She's like, guess what? I think I'm pregnant, honey. Oh, and they're so happy. Oh my God, that took forever. That literally <laughs> took forever. It took six tries and they finally got pregnant. And now they're going to joke around. Oh my God. <laughs> just like that. I'm going to have Edric go take care of this little one. He do be hungry before he heads off to work here. I'm going to have him go out and bottle field, feed him. And we will find out what's wrong. And I'm not sure where this goat has gotten to. He has disappeared again. Oh, the goat is right here. And he's fine. I think the ranch hand is taking care of them all. We don't have to worry about it, yo. We don't have to worry about it. But the brand hand, hand is not taking care of this one at all. So that's why I'm having him do it. And she in here cleaning. I think she need to eat some. She's starving. Yo, she's cooking is what she was doing. Oh, she was just making some. I'll let her resume it after she eats. And he's in here reading. He's sitting out here next to that reading. Oh, my gosh. And she's come out here to chat with Edric or Andrew, apparently. She coming over here to chat with him. 
He's like, guess what? You're going to be a, a big brother soon. Yo, she'd be big for first trimester. They're going to hug. I wish we could like tell him that we are expecting a baby. And he is happy. Big news. So he is very happy about hearing about him, them having a baby. Before he heads off to work, he's got a couple of hours. I'm going to have him come craft a axe real quick and see if he can get that finished and then she's gonna need i'm gonna have her come do this laundry actually no i'm gonna have her do some salted meat oh and here he is here is our help our ranch hand is cleaning little freya i'm gonna have him come scatter the feed and scatter the feed i seriously think these chickens are all glitched out. You know what? These chicks have not aged up. I'm a little bit concerned about this, okay? So what I'm gonna do, because we have the money, I'm gonna sell this and get another one. I don't think it's working, and I'm going to see if these chickens won't age up eventually. The chicken coop was custom content, so I'm just gonna get from the game here. So let me change the color to something a bit more plain or rustic here. Um, we're gonna go with this maybe and see if this doesn't work. Assign chickens, rooster chick, rooster chick. Why do we have so many? You know, I feel compelled to sell all of these because we have like so many. Oh, I'll sign them all in here. Oh, we have one too many, yo. Okay, we're gonna get rid of uh, these. I am going to trade for we're gonna trade for ingredients a couple of these rooster chicks because we have way too many yo we have way too many there we go and he's gonna have to stop doing that and go to work he's late yo he's late and edric is off to work oh and he comes even and works on the chickens he's hugging on the chicken and i sold those chickens but yeah they are still there yo they're still there so i thought i would try just selling one and I did, it got rid of it, and now it still says we have eight. Um, oh, because we had an extra assigned chickens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so we need to sell another one. We are going to trade for ingredients and produce. Maybe we have to wait when we do that. Okay, I'm gonna leave it be. I think maybe we have to wait on that one. And she's gonna come in here and make some more salted meat. I'm gonna have him go ahead and start a gathering with his little friends. And here is his Aunt Beatrix. And here is Latisse. I'm gonna have him be chatting with Latisse here. He's gonna give her a hug. He's gonna tell him an outrageous story and heartfelt compliment. Okay, so we did sell the one chick. And here he is just chatting with Latisse and hanging out. Oh, and this guy is stuck behind the chair, it looks like. Oh, he's like, you are my favorite, Latisse. I just really like you. Oh, and this guy is heartbroken. I don't know why. I'm going to have him come over here and try and cheer him up and give him a hug and discuss his interests. Okay, I think he needs to be reset. Yo, he won't move. Okay, I do think this little kid is stuck. All right, listen, you need to move and do this laundry, first of all. Add flowers of an orchid because I think this little boy got stuck behind here. And I'm going to have to uh, move this out for a second. There we go. We got it. And now we can put this back. There we are. Spend a little time with Elias. Elias has not, you have not done enough. You have not talked to him a whole lot. So you need to get your friendship up with him. And he's like, how you doing, Elias? How's everything going? I hope everything's going to be okay. Oh, I got an animation error right then. So that caused this one to get stuck now behind this chair. Dang it. It teleported them all the way out here, yo. <gasps> No, it did. It teleported him all the way out there. She come do this laundry. I don't know where Elias got to. Oh, there he is. Let's see if these boys maybe can do practice or uh, play with. Oh, we don't have an option. Why can we not play with Elias? That is weird. I don't know why he's not counting. Oh, is he already coming over here? What's going on? I don't know. Talk about besties and I don't know where he's going, yo. Why can't we do anything? He's leaving. Oh, did our club end? No. Why? Why? Why did he just leave? He like literally left. He's like, see ya. I'm leaving. 
That's why we couldn't do anything with them. What? I am going to end this gathering and then start this gathering. Maybe it will call him back over. I don't know why he just left, but he did. Okay, play with now. Now we have the options. Here, we're going to play with all of our friends. They're going to do some archery, some shooting. And of course, this one, however, got stuck behind there. So, you know. And Elias didn't come back. It's literally these two. This is all. We have this one and him. That's it. They're just playing. Oh, now she's coming. She was stuck. And here he is with his little friends playing some archery, practicing. He takes things so hard, yo. He misses and he hates it. He hates messing up. And Edric has come home. Yay. All right. And he has brought home some simoleons. I am going to have him. He didn't get a promotion. He is dead tired, y'all. He is dead tired. I'm going to have him go take a nap. Get him uh, his energy up a little bit. And then he's going to have to work on crafting this blacksmith smithing station. She's laughing at him. He literally misses. And she's like, oh, that was funny. You missed. Ah, you're not very good at this. Feels like Latisse and Elias ganged up on Andrew and ended up beating him two to one. What? Oh, they ganged up on him. Oh, no. I'm going to have him do it again and play with them. Oh, now she's not available. She's leaving, I guess. Oh, he do need to go to the bathroom. It is getting late. I'm going to go ahead and end this gathering. I didn't realize it was so late. Oh, and she's struggling, yo. She'd be struggling. She's not feeling so good. I'm going to have her clean that up. I'm just going to send him off to bed. He can get some sleep here. And here she sits. She's so happy. She's finally expecting a baby. Now she's just wondering if she's going to, you know, keep this baby. If the baby's going to make it or not. And he is up. And I'm going to try and get him to resume this axe. And then he's going to go back to bed. And here he is late to the night hours. Just pounding away. Making more weapons. Okay, he finished that. He still has halfway to go, but yo, he'd be tired. I'm going to just have him come in. We don't have any more food either. Um, he's just going to go straight to bed. And it is early morning, and they're up. Margaret and Andrew are up. Margaret is making some bread, and it is the second quarter of 1362. So we're moving on. She is now in her second. She's going to be in her second trimester in two hours here. So probably in the next episode, we'll be having a baby finally. And he's just come watching his mom and talking to her for a bit. And yo, I can't help but wonder if she isn't pregnant for two babies because she is so big for being in the first trimester. She is about to be in second trimester. But yo... Yo, there is that belly. Maybe it's the dress that just makes her look bigger. He do be real hungry. Okay, he went and gathered water. He needs to come take a bath while mom is making the meat and cheese and stuff. And she is level eight of the parenting. And he needs to get up and come and use this. Okay, so I think she finished that bread. And, oh, we need milk, I think. I don't think we have any milk. And let me see if we can make some cheese. Yeah, we don't have any milk. So I'm going to have Andrew uh, go milk this cow. And I think she's making some rice for everybody. She's decided to make some rice today. And Freya is very hungry. And if not fed Zoom, wait, where's our ranch hand? Yo, where's our ranch hand? I'm going to have her come over here and bottle feed this horse that just uh, pooped everywhere. I'm going to put, put it in the inventory. Here we go. And Andrew did get six bottles of milk now, so... We'll have him come and put those in here. Also, I forgot we do have some fruit on us. I'm going to have him eat these fruits a little bit to help with that hunger. Oh, and here's our ranch hand. Yo, here is our ranch hand. I mean, he's going to change his clothes if he wants to be in this, this uh, gameplay. Oh, and he's like, hey, nature's revenge. Oh, he did not like eating that at all. He did not like eating those at all. I am going to have him come craft a bejeweled sword and then she is gonna come make this cheese okay yo she is now in her second trimester that ba there's got to be more than one baby in there yo there's got to be more than one i'm telling you what that is a that is a twin's belly right there oh you just broke it now you're gonna have to fix it oh and he's come to fix it our ranch hand that's fantastic well he stopped him from t <gasps> no he was gonna he was gonna fix this and she stopped him and just talking with him listen oh no did he have a bladder fail what is going on in there oh he peed himself dang it oh no he peed himself he did it <laughs> i didn't realize he had to go to the bathroom that bad 
<laughs> oh no, somebody had a potty accident. It's been a while since we had a potty accident. <laughs> oh no. Okay, we got this done. And so we'll put this in our inventory. I'm gonna have her repair it. She stopped the ranch hand from doing it. But I'm gonna take... Edric is gonna be going off to work here in just a minute. But I'm gonna take uh, Margaret and Andrew over to visit Mabel. Mabel has had her baby. So I'm curious to see what she has had. And today's mail has been delivered. All right, we'll get everything from that. And then we're gonna make this. Uh, we'll go ahead and make pantry foods of meat and cheese. And there we have it. And I'll put this over here and she can have some of this. Edric has made that bejeweled sword. So this is the sword he has made right here. Ooh, it is fancy. He's really improved in his skill. He's getting higher up in this. Wow, okay. So we'll go ahead and put that in here. Wow, the quality is stepping up a notch right here. Look at that. Fancy swords. All right. Oh, he doesn't go to work. Wait, why is he not going to work, yo? It says he works in 24 hours. Oh, he's got different days off. Okay. I got used to these careers. A lot of times will just be Monday through Friday. I got used to that. So apparently with this mod, the blacksmith mod uh, that puts in the skill and everything, they change. So he has today off. That's amazing. So I'm going to have them all go over to Mabel's then. She finished eating. And we're going to go over to Mabel's now. Look, okay, look. This is a good shot right here. Tell me this woman is not carrying twins. Oh my God, she's got to be pregnant with twins. Okay, anyways, we're going to come knock on the door and come visit here. Mabel and Frank are out here in the yard. And he's going to do some sit-ups, I guess. Okay, so where's this baby? Let's come into this room. Here it is. Oh, Frank's coming to take care of. Who is this? Of course, I don't know. I don't know if what they had. It won't tell me. So we're going to have to wait until he's done feeding this baby or whatever he's doing. I don't know what he's doing over there. I think he's just holding her. Oh, he's just, oh, is he just holding her? Oh, he's just holding the little baby. Oh, and Mabel is just doing some housework. Okay, let's come talk to this baby. And ooh la la, would you say that Margaret likes flirtation? After being swept off her feet by Edric's flirty advances, Margaret feels like the birds are singing a little bit sweeter. Okay, what are they doing? They're in here. Oh my gosh, they're just so in love, these two. And apparently she is telling an outrageous story. I want her to come over here and talk to this baby. I don't know if it's a boy or a girl. I can't tell. So I have to look on here. So where's this baby? Does this baby show up? Deanna. Okay, so they had a little girl. Oh my gosh, Mabel is out here washing clothes while her husband watches. What? <laughs> He's just like, yep, you are, you are a trooper. Look at that. She's washing clothes. He's literally watching. <laughs> I'm going to have Edric come talk with him. We're going to tell a joke. We're going to discuss some smithing techniques. And we're going to talk about the warm temperature. And we're going to uh, gossip about the liturgy. And here she is just enjoying that little baby. Aww. She's cleaning now. She is cleaning for her. How nice is that? And now she'll be feeling some flirtiness. And here's Andrew just watching the adults talk. He's like, oh, okay, yep, yep. And now he's gonna join in talking there. I'm gonna have her, she's mopping up a storm. Are these like unloaded move? Oh, they're used and soaked, but we'll hang them up for her anyway. We're gonna come over here to her and we're gonna talk with her. Did you hear about the new Pope? Do you know who he is? And we're going to uh, give some parenting tips to her, to Mabel. We're gonna share the big news with Mabel, say, hey, Congratulations on having a baby girl. Guess what? I'm pregnant too. I think I might be having twins. I'm not sure though. And now she'd be feeling silly. And it just got awkwardly quiet as Mabel just jumped down into the push-ups. Listen, we're going to talk about cooking with her and we are going to talk about the cloudy weather. All the adults are sitting right here, just chatting, having a good time, catching up. And where is Andrew? Andrew's out here playing by himself. Oh, he is a very creative sim, however. And I'm going to get Edric come see the baby real quick before we leave. And we're going to talk and we're going to coo at him. Oh, she on it, man. She on it. Taking care of that baby right away. Oh, and she's breastfeeding her. Oh, they never do that. Oh, she got, got to go to the bathroom. Oh, she does. 
she has to go so bad. I'm going to have him come back over here and cuddle real quick. There we go. Just to get him in our friends list here. He's like, no, leave my baby alone. Oh, she had to go to the pot, I guess. Everybody does. Okay, they all got to go to the pot. I'm going to have him go back home now. We just, I just wanted to get them to meet the baby and find out what they had. Now, quick, come and use this. Oh, she'd be tired, yo. She'd be real tired all of a sudden. I mean, it is five in the evening, yo. I'm going to have him eat some of this because there is one left. Did we get counted on this? Okay, so we did get that complete. So when he goes to work 19 hours, he should get a promotion. And here they sit enjoying their evening dinner. One's got meat and cheese and the other one has got rice. And he's talking about archery with her, I guess. He is discussing archery. He's like, so have you had Andrew be practicing the archery? You know, that war is going to be coming back around. He might have to go. I don't think it's ever going to end. Hey, our ranch hand is here. Listen, our ranch hand is here. And we're going to make him change his clothes. Oh, and he do the laundry for us? What's he doing? He just, what was, he changed it for us, yo. But you got rid of our, our, oh, what? He just changed the water. It wasn't even dirty, yo. It wasn't even dirty. No, it wasn't. I'm going to have her unload their clean and dry. And then she can add the laundry. Flowers. We're going to have to, uh, we're going to have to go pick some flowers, I think, in the morning. We're going to go ahead and scatter the feed. How many of these do we have now? We have zero eight. What? Okay. I do think this is bugged out a bit. It says we have zero. Uh, it says we have no nothing. Listen, assign chickens. Why it be doing that? I do not know. Okay, now they're all in there. It says we have eggs to collect, so I'm going to have him do that. And scatter the feed and scatter the feed. I am going to have Edric. I'm going to get Edric to uh, practice archery. And she's going off to bed. She is just like so tired and wore out. All right, you guys. I think I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here. So we are just ending the second quarter of 1362. And Margaret here is going to be in her third trimester in 14 hours. And yeah, so we're going to probably in the next episode, we'll be having another baby or babies. I still think I she feel I feel like she's really big. So I, I'm thinking she might have twins. So maybe that's why it took so long for her to get pregnant. <laughs> They're waiting on twins. I don't know. But anyways, that's going to be it. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't yet subscribed, it would be amazing if you did. And also don't forget to click the little bell to get notified whenever I have a video go up. And I hope you all have a great rest of your day. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.